Hadlaj Integrity. I mean, let's let's talk about it. New fragrances. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Here's some codes to save you some cash on your next Middle Eastern niche or designer fragrances. What's going on guys? My name is Neve. Welcome back to Aromatics. Today we're going to be talking about three new fragrances from the house of Khadlaj. Khadlaj is known for some of their, their fragrances that are really hits in the market. One of the best Amouage um, Reflection Man clones or inspired by is called Shiaka for Men, the red plaque. I love the red one, but I also really love the blue one. I think it's blind by worthy. Along with their Ghaif, which is phenomenal. It's, in my opinion, better than Asad Latava's Asad. It's creamy, it's vanilla, it's stronger, etc. However, they've come out with a lot of new fragrances, and I saw a lot of their fragrances back in 2023 in October in their convention. And these are a part of some of those new fragrances. I'm very excited because they're becoming available in the States now. I'll put a bunch of links where you can find these and how you can save some money on them. But today we're gonna be talking about three fragrances from the house of Khadlaj. And I'm pretty impressed with these, otherwise, I wouldn't be talking about them. Number one is going to be Kuros, and this is called Blue Spice. I think a lot of people are gonna be happy with what this is inspired by. There's also this one right here, it's called Valor. Mystique. I wanted to put it in the presentation so you guys can kind of see what you're getting with this one. You get the uh, cardboard box, but you also get a hard case. And on the inside of the hard case, you get the, the bottle itself. Not bad, especially if you're going to be collecting all of them. It'll be really nice to stand next to each other. I do have to say, though, that the cap is plastic. It snaps on a place you can carry it, and the base is a pretty, it's a plastic as well. So Valor Mystique, and lastly is going to be Khedlej 25 year anniversary fragrances, and this is called Integrity. They have a few of them from this lineup. This one's going to be Integrity. Integrity, I think they have a couple of other ones that are uh, named in some similar fashion. But anyways, Integrity, and this is what it looks like. Like. So premium presentation, pretty nice in my opinion, and that's what you get in here. But what's more important than all of that is going to be the scent profiles. This is called Blue Spice Kuros, and it's actually a pretty damn good one. So if you noticed, I took my hat off and changed my clothes. Yeah, I just kind of teleported. This is the future Neep coming back to let you know that this is actually ridiculously close to Louis Vuitton's imagination. My current, like, number one in terms of Louis Vuitton's imagination. For this price point, this is ridiculously close. It has all of the same notes. Even in the note breakdown, you'll notice it. It's got that same neroli, white florals, etc. the watery quality to it, something aromatic. This is it. This is literally spot on to imagination. Sure, it's gonna be slightly... I mean, imagination lasts all freaking day. It's not my personal favorite, imagination. I like a lot of their other fragrances, but I know a lot of people love that DNA. Karos Blue Spice is the absolute number one inspiration on Louis Vuitton's imagination. White florals, some watery quality to this fragrance as well. You can rock this on a vacation. It smells like a vacation with white florals. If you like Neroli, etc., you're going to absolutely love this one. This is the best take on that DNA. When I wore this one, which is why I'm coming back from the future into this video, is where I really sensed like this was a watery, it smelled almost like honeyed water. Like I was wearing honeyed rose water, or honeyed white floral water. It's Neroli. It's the Neroli orange undertone. So it's kind of like this watery orange undertone and honeyed aspect or something about it. It was just addicting. The entire day I was going back for sniffs for that white floral nuance. An excellent fragrance. Gets attention as well. I got a compliment while wearing this fragrance. Karas Blue Spice at this price point is absolutely the number one in terms of how close it gets. So if you guys like Louis Vuitton's imagination, this is it. Simple as that. It's not as strong or as projecting, but it still projects and it lasted easily eight to nine hours for me. This is a no brainer. If you enjoy that fragrance, pick this bad boy up. It's solid. All right, back to the past or whatever. Peace. So it smells pretty high quality. This one right here, Kuros Blue Spice. So I think this one's gonna be a phenomenal one in terms of how it stacks up next to the original. And it smells already like it's beating some of the other inspirations. This is an excellent one. It kind of gives me like lemon head vibes for whatever reason, just in the opening. Slightly sweetened, citric, crisp, etc. The next one we're gonna be talking about is called Valor Mystique. And Valor Mystique smells a lot like Tom Ford's Oud Wood. Probably one of the strongest oud woods that I got my nose to. However, there are a lot of other oud wood inspirations out there. But right away, I'm just going to speak for this one. Right away, as soon as I put my nose to it, it smells high quality. There isn't much of an alcohol opening. And you will be surprised that this is coming out of a fragrance that's for less than 60 bucks. You cannot tell. Like, if you spray this on, you absolutely cannot tell. This smells really good. If you're looking for an oud wood inspiration, Valor Mystique smells fantastic. We're gonna let this one dry down a little bit. Last but not least, this is a great one as well, and I think this has to be my favorite one, Integrity 25. So with this one, I don't think it's an actual inspiration of anything for me personally. So Integrity 25 smells like it has the base DNA of something like Stronger With You. However, it's much different than just that. This is much more of a twist and makes this one one of my favorite from this entire uh, collection or from this entire 
alcohol. So this smells like what I personally wanted Stronger With You Freeze to smell like. So better than Stronger With You Freeze. It's not as sweet or as rich as something like Stronger With You Original, and I really appreciate the fact that it's not anything that's distinctively cloning. Personally, I love the Stronger With You DNA, and this makes it a little bit fresher. It adds more citruses. You get this lemon zest, and you get this aquatic slightly. It's almost like if Invictus Aqua had a baby with Stronger With You Freeze. That's kind of what I get with this one. So a little bit different, very versatile. I think everybody can rock this one very easily, easily inoffensive. School, gym, office, literally anywhere. This is a 10 in my opinion, easily. So there you have it. That's the fragrance haul that I recently purchased from Khadlaj. This one is going to be the most unique of them all. It's called Blue Spice. I would personally take this one on a vacation. It starts off pretty cit citrus forward, zingy, along with those aromatics, watery, and then the dry down gets a little bit creamier from that labdanum, some ambers, it warms up. It smells very unique. It smells expensive, the scent profile. This has to be one of the better ones in my opinion. And lastly is going to be Tom Ford's Oud Wood or Valor Mystique. Very rich and smells very dense right from the opening. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. These are my favorite ones, Integrity 25 and Blue Spice, not bad. Make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button. Till the next video, peace.